How did this happen? Oh, great. What's up, guys? We're back with another epic, not really epic video. In today's video, I have a little story for you guys. I was checking out my booster boxes that are behind me. I don't know if you guys can see that. We got some boxes back there. Yeah, you guys might be able to see them right behind my shoulder. But I was checking those out, and I was just going through them to see, like, for a few things with my trade and do some stuff. And I noticed uh, one box and I was like, oh, okay, this looks, uh, this looks like a nice box, you know, pretty cool. What happened? This thing used to be sealed from what I remember. Look at this. There is, <laughs> it's not only not sealed, like a little bit of a hole, like this thing is completely ripped open. So I don't know if when I got this, this thing was like this and I just didn't notice. I feel like there's no way I could not have noticed this. But as soon as I grabbed this, I was like, wait a second. <laughs> what, what is up here? So this Extreme Victory f First Edition box, uh, I think it's First Edition. Yeah, it's like not sealed anymore. So this is actually a pretty expensive box. You know, it's a couple few hundred maybe even i'm not sure the exact price but it's pretty expensive so at this point it's open so we can't really keep it as a sealed booster box so i figured you know what guys this uh weird event happened so i guess that means we're opening it but before we get into it we have a giveaway i'll be giving away this exodia set from yugi's legendary decks all five pieces all you have to do is like this video be subscribed turn on notifications let me know what you want to see out of here and has this ever happened to you you've had something sealed maybe like a blister pack and then you come back later and it's fallen it's like the glue has you know come off i don't know if that's what happened here maybe like it was like barely sealed and then like it rubbed up against something and it just came off i don't know or maybe i just didn't notice that's probably the most likely thing but it's pretty weird because i've had this for months at this point and just now noticed so we're gonna get into it and see if we can pull that tour guide and as we're getting into it i want to remind you guys to never send anyone in the youtube comments money don't talk to them on telegram or whatsapp or anything like that youtube giveaways will only be announced on the youtube community tab so keep that in mind i don't want you guys to get scammed so i wanted to mention that as much as i can recently because people have been messaging me over and over and over and over we're talking like probably hundreds of messages at this point thinking they want a giveaway so it, it didn't actually happen unfortunately and uh we are a little bit behind on the giveaways by the way they have not been uh, announced in maybe a month or so and they have not been uh, uh shipped out for a lot of people yet so we're going to be working on that soon all right we have 24 packs we are looking good inside we can pull a ghost or a junk berserker we can pull tour guide i mean tour guide first edition is pretty valuable so so that'd be pretty sick if we could pull that. We have pulled that before on the channel. Uh, the very first time I opened this booster box a long time ago. And uh, I didn't really want to open this booster box, but sometimes you got to do it. You know, if uh, it just rips open and all of a sudden you got to open it. Let's see what we can get. We got the Force Resonator. We got the Fortissimo, the Mobile Fortress. Lancer Linworm. The Back Time Blast. The TG Catapult Cannon. Cool. Scarlet Security. Jar Turtle. And the TGX3 a DX2. Okay, DX3, DX2. A lot of numbers, a lot of letters in there. Also, I want to remind you guys that 150,000, we will be opening every single Yu-Gi-Oh! pack ever made again for the second time. Except this time, we're not going to stop recording. And... Okay, you got one of the security cards in here. And not only that, we are going to have even more or like packs to open this time because, you know, it's been two years, over two years. So more packs have been added. So it should be a pretty amazing one. So hit that subscribe button. We're like less than 7,000 away. We're getting close. Fortissimo, we got the Lancer Lindworm. We got the Ceiling Ceremony. TG Jet Falcon, the Resonant Destruction. Karkuri Kamachi, very nice, the Red Carpet. Unknown Synchron and the necro defender so we are starting it off 0 for 2 so in these like 5ds boxes you do tend to get more foils i don't know if that's going to be the case here or not but we will see we don't really do just straight up booster box openings very often anymore so this is still going to be pretty fun we have one two three four let's see if we can get something crazy morphtronic lantron i've never pulled the ghost out of the set so it's not super valuable but i would still love to pull it for you know my binder and stuff psychic reactor i think i have near mint but this would be minty so we'd probably keep that scrap kong or i could grade it of course esper in the tg rust rhino tgs are actually pretty cool they were in uh dual links for a little bit i learned how to play some of those cards like the rush rhino etc so we have not pulled anything yet so was this just a resealed box that they didn't completely reseal it could be it could be we might have gotten scammed months ago and not known ceiling ceremony the tg jet falcon the contact elder of the six samurai reboot psychic reactor mech lord army the scrap kong and blackwing Jin, the rain shadow very very nice um except the fact that it wasn't a foil and we have not pulled a foil yet so that's it's not that nice. This is what happens every time I shuffle up the packs. All the foils just, you know, they just don't want to pop out. All right, one, two, three, four. We have the Force Resonator, 
the Red Dragon Vase, Lancer Linworm, the Mechlorm Army of Rizel, Wizel, Red Carpet, the Scrap Kong, the TGSX1, the Clock Resonator, and the Psy Beast. Oh, okay. There's foils in here, right? Totally. There's definitely foils in this box. Ah, nothing to worry about here, guys. Definitely foils in this box. I am not worried. We're definitely getting a ghost shirt, or it's an error box where it only has ghost rares as foils red dragon vase the wn nebula meteorite the tg1 em1 the force resonator tyrant's tantrum out of the blue scrap kong boon of the mech lord emperor and soundproofed all right so what are we like 0 for 6 0 for 7 at this point great start looking good but wait 50% of you guys are not subscribed to the channel according to this graph. So go down below and click that subscribe button. Also, I think this came out like 2011. So this is over 10 years old, if you can believe that. Over 10 years old for a 5D set. Pretty insane. It was the last one, I believe, for 5Ds. I just ripped that pack up. So uh, pretty special in that regard. But outside of that, not the craziest set. But it does have a couple of good ones. Mental Seeker, Power of the Up Adapter, the Power of the Up Adapter. I'm struggling. Red Carpet, Scrap Kong, the TGSX1, and the Salvage Warrior. Salvage Warrior. Okay. Did we open a resealed box? That is the question. Or whatever you would call that. Resealed? I don't know if you would call that resealed. If you don't seal it all the way, does it count as resealed? I don't think so. So I don't know what we would call that. We got a Mental Seeker. We've got the Gladiator Beast Tigarius. The Jet Falcon. Tigarius sounds like a Caesar or something. Sealing Ceremony. We've got the Tyrant's Tantrum. Clock Resonator. The Runaway Kawakuri. Morphtronic Staplin. TGX3 DX2, all right. All right, Extreme Victory, this is your chance. Step it up and get a foil. We have a uh, another security tag to three. What did they have? Wait, did they have those in booster boxes? Why would it be in individual packs? Maybe this is resealed, I don't know. Contact Elder the Six Samurai TGX1. Oh, Rux and Special. Six Style Dual Wield, the Mech Time Blast, the Karakuri Kamachi Reboot, uh, Clock Resonator, and psychic fuel zone okay it's another rare why would someone reseal extreme victory there's no way they would right there's no way this is resealed it's extreme victory there's only like two good cards in here two three four i don't know we're about to find out let's just keep going esp amplifier mechlord factory oh we got a rux and special with a lantron i was, uh, I was doing so good now two rux and specials army of the wizel the staple and the runaway car curry the tg catapult cannon tyrant's tantrum Mechlord Army of Grinnell. So right now, we're I think we're supposed to get like eight foils out of these. We are one for 11 or 0 for 11. This is starting to look real sketch. Okay, anything look weird here? These have to be like, wait, wait, wait. What's going on here at the bottom? Is there something going on there? I don't know. I can't tell. Uh, what, we're going to start checking them out as we go. Let's keep going. Gladiator Beast Tigarius, the Mechlord Factory. We've got the Aurora Paragon, the Elder of the Six Samurai, TGX 300, Mech Time Blast, Karakuri Nanishi, Rest and Destruction, and Psy Beast. Oh my good, guys. Okay, so we opened half the box. We have pulled nothing. We might have gotten scammed. I mean, these look fine for the most part. Let's inspect them as we go. So let's see the bottom. Maybe. Is there something going on here? Let's see when we open this thing up. Well, let's do a little, a little inspection. Also, wait a second. Isn't this supposed to be folded this way? I don't really know. Wait. Let's see anything look sketchy there. Okay, a little little bit of a gluey look. That can be normal, but it can also be sketch. Okay, maybe we just shuffle them all. Are we freaking out too early? We're gonna find out. Did we get scammed? It's it's been a while since we've been scammed, so maybe it's time to get scammed. <laughs> maybe it's just time. Mental seeker. Okay. Glad I'd be Tigarius. We've got the uh, TG Jet Falcon, the like ceremony of Mokotum, Scrap Kong, the TGSX1, the clock resonator, psychic reactor, and tgx3 dx2 okay so uh and also another thing these are making me think that these weren't from this box originally because why would you have a security tag like you would have like in a store so like if you walk out with it and steal it you know it you know goes off why would that be in a booster box like why would it be in the individual packs in a booster box it's kind of weird like i don't know it seems a little odd but maybe that is a thing they did let me know in the comments if that's a thing they did i don't know if they did or not but there's another one all right so that. We have the uh, Boon of the Mechlord Emperor, Esper Girl. We've got... Wait, we have a foil! Wait! What? Where was that foil in the pack? 
That's a super rare. Why was that the third card? Wait, did we not get scammed? Did we just shuffle all of the foils to the end somehow? Debunk super rare. Okay, that's a foil. Okay, we got something. All right, now I'm just confused. How many packs are left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so we opened 13 packs and got no foils. Then we pulled a super rare. So this means we have 10 packs left. We should have like seven foils. So if, if this is a real box, then we're going to start pulling foils like crazy. If this is like regular ratio, I'm supposed to go like this. Yeah, I think I messed it up last time. The Resolute Mech Lord Army. Okay, the Resolute Desk. All right, Nicholas Cage. We've got the TG1 EM1, the Mental Seeker. Localized Tornado. We've got the Out of the Blue. Morphtronic Stapling, the Runaway Karakuri. And TG Striker. Okay, so right now we are now one for 13. Doesn't feel like there's going to be more foils unless we're just getting crazy unlucky, which is definitely possible, I would say. All right, ESP Amplifier. Maybe they left that Super Rare in by accident. Morphtronic Lantron, Mech Lord Army of Wizel, Unknown Synchron, Scarlet Security, Axe Dragonute. Oh, and the TG Wonder Magician. Okay, maybe we did shuffle them all to the end. The TG Wonder Magician Ultra Rare. Very nice. We will take that. So maybe it wasn't a resealed box. Maybe it did just open up on its own somehow. Do you guys think booster boxes want to be opened? Maybe maybe the booster box opened itself. Yes, maybe Toy Story 4 booster boxes involved. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, it could be. Wait, was there already a Toy Story 4? Wait, there already was a Toy Story 4, wasn't there? Maybe Toy Story 5, 2, 3, 4, because they had that one with like Woody and, and Jesse like breaking up or something. Isn't that what happened? Let me know in the comments. TGX1 with the six style dual wield. Tigarius, we got the ESP amplifier, the Mech Lord Army of Skiel, Red Carpet, Scrap Kong, TGSX1, and a full house. Okay, so we're at two foils. We have eight packs, seven packs to go. So almost every one has to be a foil at this point, I think, to be like normal ratio for five Ds. I don't know. Let's just see two. But five Ds is known some of the sets specifically for having crazy ratios and like just going off the wall and like not doing what you expect. OK, there we go. Ceiling ceremony, the elder of the six samurai car curry. We got the red carpet, unknown synchron and a TG cyber magician. There's a super rare right there. Okay, we're getting the foils now. Two supers, one ultra. We have six packs to go. Let's see if we can finish it off with like an ultimate, a secret. Can we get one of those at least? This is one of the weirdest openings we've had. So it was a weird situation, first of all. The box was opened randomly, and now the box is being insane and like really saving the foils for the end. Okay, really, really trying to help with the retention, apparently, of the video. So I think if we go like this... This is like the rare and this is like the foil. Usually let's go like this. All right. Contact with the Aqua Mirror, the Elder of the Six Samurai, the TGX1 HL, Dual Wheel, Tyrant Tantrum. Now I'm expecting foils in every pack. Clock Resonator, the Kara Curry, the TG Striker and Morphtronic Staplin. OK, I can you know, stop expecting those because another one without a foil. We have two total foils. OK, looking strong. I thought wasn't it? I think it's Absolute Power Force is the one with like the crazy ratios, isn't it? two, three, four. So I don't think that, I think that would be the one we'd have to worry about. All right, we have the contact with the Aqua Mirror, the Elder of the Six Samurai. This gets a super later, the TGX1 HL, Dual Wheel, Tyrant's Tantrum, Out of the Blue, Scrap Kong, Salvage Warrior from the Prison, and Livestream Dragon. Isn't this like a Signer Dragon or something? Isn't this technically a Signer Dragon? Livestream Dragon, does this have an ultimate rare in the set? Or is it just an ultra? That's actually kind of sick. Livestream dragon. Pretty, pretty cool. We will take that. All right, we're down to four now. We've pulled, what, four foils? So four in a row. That gets to the ratio, I think. We have the sealing ceremony of Makantunan, Makaton. We've got the Force Resonator, the Red Dragon Vase, Lancer Linworm, the TGX 300, the Mech Time Blast, Karakuri, Kamachi, MDL 224, Nanishi. We've got the Mech Lord Army of Grinnell. And we have Debunk again. In. All right, we've got a double super rare, and then we've got a couple of synchros as our ultra. We got a, all right, TG Cyber Magician. That's pretty weird, but all right, just a debunk. Who cares? Um, let's just keep going, see if we can get something actually good out of here. Let's see. What's debunk being one of those supers that's like 20 bucks, and it's like, yeah, you shouldn't uh, tr talk trash about me. I'm worth 20 bucks, but it's probably worth 20 cents, let's be honest. All right, the power up adapter. Very nice. You need to charge your iPhone. There you go. Mech Lord Army of Wazelle, the TG Warwolf, Red Dragon Vase, Unknown Synchron, Tyrant's Tantrum, Clock Resonator, TG Striker, and... Runaway car curry. Okay, so maybe the ratios are not eight. Maybe I was just wrong about that. I could be. Who knows? Okay, we just got to believe, guys. Just got to believe that we can do it. We just got to believe. There's going to be a secret or an ulti. At least one of the two, right? One, two, three, four. Believe in the heart of the cards. Mental seeker. 
Power Up Adapter, the Mech Lord Army of Wazel, TG Warwolf, Mech Time Blast, the Karakuri Kamachi, MDL 224 Nanishi, Resonant Destruction, Junk Servant, actually worth a couple bucks, and Mech Lord Army of Skiel. Yay. I don't know what to think about this, because if there's only Ultras and Supers in here, it's like, well, it's don't think it's resealed, but like, this is the worst box ever, you know? I've seen weird boxes in 5Ds. It, it can happen. So I'm hoping that we just shuffle like the Ghost or the Ulti or the Secret to the back. Let's just see. Morphtronic Lantron, let's go. Mechlord Army of Wazel, the Resolute Mechlord Army, Mental Seeker, Tyrant's Tantrum, the Clock Resonator, Runaway Karakuri, Mechlord Fortress, and the final pack of the weirdest opening we've had in a very long time. Will it be a Ghost Share, Ultimate Rare, or Secret Rare? Let's go. No, it's a common. All right. Okay, great. This has been a very great opening. We have three supers and two ultras out of an entire box. Okay, great. I'm really glad this thing decided to open itself. Definitely worth the opening. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more epic content. Shout out to TCG Trusted Cards, Tonefo Show, Tomato Juice, Daxter, JT Chill, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanna, Squirtle, Flexi Boy, Hoppus, Dizzy, Stanley, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, John Nolan, Ananda Tai Show, Thomas McLean, Seth Fisher, and Tone Z. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.